here i am chris palmer with chrispalmermarketing.com and in today's video what i'd love to share with you is why you're not visibly ranking so this problem comes up consistently i've had countless clients where this has came up whether it's consultation clients or whether it's month to month clients and they're like chris my impressions my clicks my website clicks my phone calls are dramatically declining and here's the reason why but before i get into that i have to point out please take the time check out chrispalmermarketing.com for any and all of your seo needs whether you need services consultation or if you just want to learn more i have you covered with that being said let's go ahead and dive into this issue all right because it's plaguing business owners just like you and I, I don't like it I know that you don't so I have a client in mind that this has happened to and I want to point out the issue and I'm sure you're gonna be right on board with me let's head on now to Google all right so let's go together and let me point this out all right so we're on Google I have a client uh, they're in Miami great lady great company they do duck removal let me show you something this is one of the instances that this has happened. It's disgusting, right? I was going to say disgraceful because it is. So we have duck removal. All right. So my client, we're doing great organic. Number one organic. That's not the problem. The problem is, is that call volume and impressions and website clicks from GMB are dramatically declining for our primary service. Duck removal. Huge problem in Florida. Okay. You might not believe it, but it's true. With that being said, here's the problem and here's what keeps coming up. We have guarantee up here, okay? Sometimes there's three listings up there. Bam, that knocks us down. Now we have ads here, sponsored organic ads, two separate products from Google. That knocks us down. And here's the best part, the, sh the part that I'm sure that you love. When we scroll down, where's the map pack? Well, it's actually all the way down here to that number 24, almost on page three. And then you have a client coming back that's doing great business, helping the community out, right? Offering a phenomenal service just like you. And my call volume is going down. It's being sucked up by ad space. And this person, how long have they, 48 years? Okay, I'll give it to them. But nonetheless, it still doesn't, imp it still impacts my client. And it's probably impacting you so how do we fix this right we got sponsored ads google guarantee and the map pack is being moved to page three how do we start regaining back traction let me share with you how you can retune and optimize the google business profile because even though they're taking away primary terms google's still giving you something now, I can't actively go into this client's account because we're still actively working, but I can go into a past client's and show you some of the details, all right, and what you're looking for, all right? So here, come on over here to this particular profile, all right? This is in another country. It's this, I, I can show you this one, all right? So what we're looking at here is we're going to go to this particular profile, all right? So we're inside this Google business profile. This is a good friend of ours uh, with Chris Palmer Marketing. What we're looking at here is I, I want to point out, all right, I shared with you that example. This isn't happening necessarily in Romania as much, but what we're going to be looking at here is we want to go into performance, all right? The primary search terms that you're optimizing your website around, right? In the past example, I showed duck removal. So for duck removal, we know that for that exact phrase, duck removal in Miami, yes, guarantee organic ads. And then we, our map pack is being shifted down. What you want to do is you want to head into your Google business profile, your analytics, or however you're tracking your current ranking and your results. You want to get into the back end. I like just using Google's, uh, Google, Google business profile analytics because it's Google's data. They're feeding it to us. So what we want to do is when we log in here, we want to take a look at our website clicks. We want to take a look at our phone calls, but most notably, when we're dropping down, we want to take a look at our overview, okay? Once we have diagnosed that problem, we want to scroll down just a little bit, and we want to take a look here at this particular region here. What this is, is it's giving us our searches broken down search by search. So we know previously that we were receiving a lot of phone calls and a lot of traction and website clicks and everything was for our primary search phrases. When you come in, 
you're going to see that, hey, you're still getting calls. You're still getting that volume that you were getting, but you're on a decline down, right? So what you need to do is you need to figure out, well, what is Google giving us now? So what we're going to be doing here is we need to see, well, they might not be giving us the primary, but are they giving us the keyword in this instance? Was it biomed scan or the past one? They're, they're still getting searches for duck removal Miami or humane duck removal Miami, right? Like which variation are they giving you? What are they giving you? Once you realize that, hey, they took away the primary, but they're still giving you something, we need to optimize the profile around that. Let me share with you the next steps. What you want to do next is once you figure out that, hey, they took away my primary, boo-hoo, it sucks. I know, but they're giving us these phrases. We're going to go into the profile like this, all right? Under this particular option here inside of products, what you want to do is you want to click on products. Inside of your product section, you want to list your primary category. Don't change it, right? Like that past example was duck removal, right? Don't change that. Keep that as the primary category. So for this instance, it would be like this. We have our primary categories. He doesn't have products under his category. But in this instance, I could go like this. Here's the category. It could be duck removal, right? We're going to add a product under duck removal, but we're going to target the phrase that Google's giving us. Like for instance, duck removal is the primary. They dropped me on that. I'm not getting any phone calls or any traffic, but they are giving me traffic for humane duck removal, Miami. That's the product name. That's what we're going to stick in there. Oh, you're not showing me for this, but you're going to show me for this. Well, let's double down on what you're showing me for so I can subtract and extract more traffic and clicks for that. Hopefully that makes sense to you, right? Let me get that call. All right. Now, with that being said, we're going to go ahead and move forward here. Oh, sorry. All right. Sorry about that. <laughs> so let's keep going. So that is going to be the products. Now, under services, things have changed over the past few months. Now, Google is going to recommend all types of different names, right? They're going to put all types of stuff in there. But this is not, these are not the services that are listed on your website, right? They put all types of recommendations. Google is not in the business to help you. They want you to buy ads. And if you don't believe me, look at how many products they have centralized around ads. And look where they put your map listings. Wait, you don't believe it? Look at this. Duck removal. There, it used to show at the top. Look at this. Guarantee, sponsored, and look at map packs down the page. If this hasn't happened to you yet, it can. And it, and it might. So be prepared. And that's what I'm, I'm trying to put you in position for. All right. So with that being said, under services... We're not going to take their recommendations. We're going to take our keywords that we're ranking for, okay? Well, again, we're coming to performance and we're gonna see, hey, I was getting good traction for my primary term, but now I'm not. What am I getting traction for, right? We're gonna figure that out and we're still going to optimize around the head term because we don't wanna lose that. Under our primary category, keep that in there. In our products, we're going to start placing products that are geared around the secondary terms that Google is rewarding us for. That's actually driving business to our actually website clicks, calls, impressions, how people are actually finding us. We're optimized in the category under products for the primary, but we're going to have secondary products for the terms of how people are actually finding us and how you find those terms as it's listed in here. You're with me so far? Okay. The next thing is we want to optimize the same thing for services. Like I mentioned before, don't take the recommendations that Google gives you. They're not your friend, okay? What you need to do is we want to put our primary services in there plus the secondary terms that people are actually finding us for, which is listed in here. And where you want to put that is under your services, all right? We want to start grabbing. Don't take out your primaries. Don't accept Google's recommendations. Put the primary plus the new ter terms that people are actually finding you for. That's what you stick in here, all right? Either that or get rid of it. It's up to you. But this is my recommendation so far. Now, there's one more thing that needs to be done, all right? In order to maximize the amount of phone calls and leads and traction that you're getting. So we took care of products. We took care of services. Here's the next thing that you need to do, okay? We're going to go back into our performance. 
We're going to see how people are finding us. We're not changing anything that we currently have because you're optimized around the head term, right? When you created the business, you're creating your business around chiropractor plus city, personal injury plus city, right? Don't take those things out. Don't change those. But what we need to add to our pages in the body content on those primary pages is the terms of how they're actually finding us. Why? Because our website needs to mirror our Google business profile because we're going to have it in our products and we're going to add it to our services. So it needs to show up on the site. You with me? So this is how you can start regaining back your visibility. This is how you can start increasing your phone calls. This is how you can start getting more business and stop having to pay Google. My name is Chris Palmer with Chris Palmer Marketing. If you need help with any of this, please feel free to reach out. I'd be happy to walk through it. If you need, you know, if there's just a little question, ask in the section below. If you need me to do this for you, sign up, book a time. I'd be happy to help you. Again, my name is Chris Palmer, and I can't wait to see you in the next Google Business Profile, How to Rank Your Google Maps Listing video. I'll see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye-bye.